Tony Atoyebi is a 16-year-old motorcycle mechanic and generator repairer in Inlori, who has defied all odds to practice a craft in a male-dominated sector. Now, with the death of her father who trained her and the need to take care of her old grandmother, Tony braved all opposition and has become a reference point and leading light to her peers. This is off our road in Ilori Quara State. Our interest here is piqued by 16-year-old Tony, a motorcycle and generator repairer. Although the environment of the one-room apartment where she lives is not conducive and attractive, she did not allow this to deter her from earning a living and catering to her family, including her old grandmother. The nearly 80-year-old grandma tells us how Tony started following her father to the workshop from a very early age when they were still in the northern part of the country. <laughs> Her father told me that when she was around two years old, she was always fascinated by his tools. When they relocated from the north, we decided that she should understudy a few already established mechanics around, but they turned down the offers. With nowhere to go, she decided to continue working with her father, who later passed on. From the early hours of the day, the girl mechanic sets out for work, which is about five minutes' drive from her residence. Today, Tony has become a model to other young girls in the area, says this neighbor, as she goes about her job diligently. One thing with, with Tony is that she doesn't feel ashamed of any, anywhere you take her to without uniform. If they can even organize youth, or we should be given opportunity to go to any secondary school to gather. And I go, she go there and let her speak with them. It's not every situation in life can turn you to be a prostitute or to turn you to be an another thing. You for, they should face and have that, they have it in mind that God, whatsoever they lay their hand on, that God will surely bring success out of it. That is what this girl is doing. She does not, there is nothing in this world that you can give her that can entice her. However, since the demise of her father last year, who was also the breadwinner of the family, the responsibility of catering to the entire family has since shifted to the teenager. I started this work at age five. I was told by my dad that I always stay around him whenever he's working. And since then, I know I'm doing good. I'm doing very great in the work. And when we travel to, down to Ilorin here, I've been... Like, my daddy was quite sick, so I'm left alone to take care of him, walk and feed him, my family and my brothers. And with a little money I earn from it, I sustain myself. I pay, some, I pay my dad drugs, um, fees for drugs, and most of things I buy some things in school, school fees, a lot of things. The love for the job since age five, according to her, inspired her to carry on even after the death of her father. My future plan is that I should study more and become a mechanical engineer. I want her to assist me in furthering my education and to gain more things about mechanical stuff. My advice to other girls and boys that, I'm, that is my age mates is that they should stick to everything they are doing, no matter how difficult it is. They should remember that it's okay not to be okay when it is ample and it's tempered. She settles down to the day's activities. And Tony attends to a new customer who says he was attracted to her due to her commitment and determination to succeed. Uh, because of uh, what I've been seeing her doing, so that was why I was so impressed. Because I can see she has a passion for the job. So that was why I brought this uh, generator for her to repair. Uh, in fact, uh, our whole life is an encouragement to others. They should learn from her. 
at least for somebody that has that determination to put these things in place and uh, and uh, from there it was I mean she's, she's trying to do her best to get the best out of life so I advise others to to emulate her so that they can go far in life even the motor mechanics around her attest to a doggedness and determination to succeed the young girl was presently in senior secondary school in the state aspires to become a mechanical engineer in the future and would be glad to get the needed support to fulfill our wish.